Hello and welcome back to Cud Buds with Narf. We're on we're on new quality 1.0 quality 1.0 stream quality improvements. So we're making enemies uh, potential friends hated by the villagers of Sarkova. Uh, so are we skipping? Are we like are, are we friends enough with uh, plants? Oh, oh, what is that? Is that what a highly entropic being looks like when you have your? What is a monad? I've never seen that before. Delicate for highly entropic being. Fuzzy physics of earth time. The triangle is inert and of an algebraic substance. This reminds me of a uh, Alan Moore comic. Well, um, interestingly enough, since you already have highly entropic beings as your thing, you could give them 200 re reputation. And then, uh, yeah, what, what, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm like greatly in favor of that, honestly. What, but what faction would we want to sacrifice? Birds and winged mammals. Well, I mean, we have the feathered mod. We could literally just highly entropic being. I mean, they're going to give us shoes or something. <laughs> they're going to give us something that doesn't make any dang sense at all. Colossal Kosh of the Alalil village. That's strange. Choke on your spittle. Dang. All right. It's a harmonica. No, it's a uh, two AV. Oh, whoops. Oh, uh, it's a pretty good one. Plus three strength. Two hand. No, it's dirty one. I mean, that's really good. It's unfortunate we're not uh, a cudgel build. I'd be tempted to use it. Well, okay. Actually, it would be. You could use it. Oh, I guess you do use your offhand weapons. I always forget about that. New new tech, new problems. Problems have been solved. Yeah, apparently uh, I just wasn't saying anything. Yeah, Nerf was very quiet that entire time. Big Simple was just talking to himself. As I do. Yeah. Um, yeah the problem has been solved. That's the important part. I think my, my mouse accidentally maybe nudged the mute everything and create problems for myself button. Yeah. Anyway, it's a good button. I love that button. So, you know, I, it wasn't only it was only until very recently that I even knew that Ezra had a mayor. Didn't know it. I think you mentioned that a couple episodes ago. Yeah, I may have done that. It's just remarkable to me. I would yeah. miss something as obvious as that. Dominant cohort Ixer Masp gift at Hapad Hollow. Um, so back to Gridgate, we must go, I think. Yeah. Or we, <laughs> do you want to do something else? No, I'm just uh, just thinking about the state of the world you know it's been a while thinking about them beans <laughs> jacobo has restocked spare fusile has restocked mafio lying on a bed has restocked that mafio mm. oh that's a if, must yeah. yeah no reprogrammable is like good i, w I would good. i would put that on the highest high end of my like favorite item in the game I actually kind of prefer just a regular programmable, but... What do you mean a re regular programmable? There's reprogrammable and there's programmable. Oh, okay, I understand why. Yeah. It's uh, cheaper to make. This is just another thing that's going to compete for our six bits here. Well, um, for me, okay, they, they kind of serve different functions in some ways. I, yeah. um, I understand the necessity of both, but for me, reprogrammable is like when you're doing some ruin diving and you need to go dump your stuff off yep it's a good checkpoint yeah having like one reprogrammable for that is good uh a sparafushel. is that is that how you would pronounce that i've always struggled nah, with that one that's how it, that's how i funnily pronounce it you know dazzle cheek wow that's yeah. expensive what is that that's that that cud language that very uh efficiently explains to me what it does mm -hmm. i have no idea it looks like a mask though i would I would bet on mask, yeah. Well, recycling's kind of nice. Not very late game, though. Yeah, I mean, we don't really need it. I wonder if... I still um... remember the pat. Oh, sorry. No, it's fine. Go ahead. I'm gonna go. Uh, I still remember the patch in which the bears started going to sleep, and ever since then, it's just hilarious <laughs> to me. I I was laughing a little bit. I was looking through the mods because I'm I'm gonna I'm getting ready for maybe doing a modded run through Cud, um, and there's a mod. <laughs> It's really, it really cracks me up every time I see it. Violently wake up the bears. Yeah. It's like it replaces the text that gently wake up the bears with violently wake them up. And I just think that's really funny. <laughs> All right. So here's our, everyone's favorite uh, quest yeah. in Cud. Love. I don't know why I 
you're you're walked over there you have to talk to uh Eskrigel to uh get it to yeah. figure out the stability of the rock or whatever scan the surroundings it's not a terrible i'm gonna just make sure there is no other it's not a terrible i had a spawn like that and most of my bears died but it, it was probably just because i failed to because the problem with that is they can walk through the east tunnel and i don't know if there's any way to like lock that off or close it off but i think what i might do in the future is like use a little bit of force field. there's a force field on the corner on the east side right um can you like force field a little tiny do like block on that doorway and where mafio sells this stuff so that their pathfinding just goes north yeah you could also probably just uh you can close that door no there's no way that's gonna work they can open doors um but you could portable wall if we have any left i think we disassembled them all we could make you one. Could just portable wall right here oh that's a great idea but i you don't can, really care you can't tinker one up uh oh, why cool. did Rodonis? Uh, is that a bug? Oh, go. no, they take a second? No, weird. I don't know. I don't, uh, I don't activate Rodanus because, uh, shenanigans kind of make, make it, make them not helpful to me. Are you going to hang out right there? Kind of thinking about just being annoying and right here. We'll see how it goes. You still have a hundred and some amps. Do you want to, like, activate some turrets or crumbling? Eh. Okay. Shouldn't need it. Well, there they are. There they is. So let's see if I can. Uh, ah, boo. We don't right. have like, you don't have any flashbang grenades, right? I don't think I brought any, no. They did. Though. That's a lot of grenades. Uh, that all did like no damage to you, which is nice. But you are frozen, maybe? Yep. Yeah, you're frozen. I'm confused, so you don't even know where your blaze injector is. They are in. It looks like closing the door did actually help their pathfinding. I guess you, your temporal fuse means that you don't necessarily have to participate as, as uh, you know, actively. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Well, remain stunned. I think this is going well. Is yeah, it... I'm looking for the phylactery squire. I think he died in the... Mm, that guy took a chunk out of you. Yeah, how, how hard did he hit me for in the one attack, though? That's what I want to know. Could you, would you want to try proselytizing him? Mm, never mind. Never mind. He's coated in plasma. He is coated in plasma. You got any, uh, like, thermal or freeze stuff? I'm also coated in plasma. Oh, okay. Uh, honestly, I think we can just punch him. So I started uh, smashing. Uh, oh no, Shem minus one. Rip. Shem minus one always dies. I don't think he's ever not died for me. This is uh, this is going well, I suppose. Yeah. I mean, you're not even close to danger over. zone. Smack, smack, smack. Um. That was really We're quick. Good. Everyone kind of died. Yeah, they killed themselves with grenades. Like that was my goal of. Oh, I see. When they threw their grenades at you, they just they all hit themselves. Yeah. Oh, that's actually some delightful cheese. Let's I... not eat the congealed salve yeah, this yeah. time. <laughs> and then I started eating congealed salve. Cragmench. What was that sound? Was that a cragmench sound or villager of Ak I have no idea. It was like a queen. All right, nice. Yeah, now we Ooh. have we have a six bit. We've got a six bit, and so I started making reprogrammable recoilers. Ah, oh, re freeze ray. I know yeah, that's I know a, it's destined to it's the a trash. Uh, I, I really love the uh, the tile art for the freeze ray. I don't know how many we keep or uh, how many bears we lost. We'll find out. I'm sure. I'm, uh, Otho is Otho still around? Cool. Let's see if we can get rid of some stuff at Otho. You had a nice number of bears on that list. I don't know if you lost anyone. Yeah, I think Shim was the only... Ugh. <laughs> like a freeze ray. Yeah. Engraved. What is it? Ooh, oh. an ontological anchor. I never know what to do with that. I know it has something to do, again, with um, uh, 
that gas, which is very easy to understand and normality. Yeah, it's gas. a it's a normality shield. It basically stops you from being teleported. Oh. Uh, it's kind of the easiest way to think about it. Can you still be I burrowed? Think, I don't know. Mm. I might honestly want to do an entire tutorial video about normality gas and what it does and does not work against. Because it's something I wouldn't mind learning about. Carbide hand bones. Um, you're not, you're not even going to be able to walk to Otho. Every step you take, you're just going to be picking up a bunch of stuff. Oh, there we go. Uh, that's it. Yeah. Four chromelings perished. Yeah. No books, no crops, three gadgets. Wow. That was a amazing, like, Pewdis invasion. That was just like... Yeah, we got lucky that they were both in the same spot. And then it's one of the spots you can kind of close off and just be the target. I might not have ever tried that only because it seems really like it, you could I would assume I would like die from a volley of like everything. You got to be a pretty tanky build to live through that. Custom visage. True. Oh, that's an implant. That's something we sold, in fact. Yeah. Do we already know Flashbang? I think we do. Yeah, we do. Oh, it tells you that now. Yeah, it does tell you that now. We finally added that. I appreciate that. Okay, Jokobo has nothing for us to buy. Does Q Girl still have a... She has a couple gems. No, she doesn't. I oh, bought them. You already bought them. Uh, I mean, we could pick up Dazzle Cheek. We have no clue what it is. We can grab Night Sight Interpolators, but we can't, like, learn these right now. Those are all... Do we know EMP3? We don't. We EMP3 is quite nice. Yeah. It's just, like, money to spend. Are there any good bits in here? Uh, I in mean... Four bit. If you got a bunch of money to spend, I, I just like buy all the bits. It's a good way of spending like 500 rams. Yeah. I just wanted to sell off the carbide hand bones. Yeah. And grounding shunts is the best uh, cybernetic in the game. We have a lot of money. Get rid of some of these shit. We can't even carry money if we do that. Let's just. Uh... Here's a, here's a question. Um, I'm not, uh, just thinking here. What if you get electrocuted and you're grounded? Is that better or worse? No idea. I'm just wondering if there's like um if there's like an idea there to to make crowning shins have electrical resistance salty a bloody feather eh, it's all junk do you how much time do you usually spend uh cleaning up oh wow that's a nice find cleaning up great it wasn't a find i dropped it so oh, that i oops. could move oh right 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 more artifacts more stuff full rate flake armor we're already we've already got some really good flake armor I don't know if we've modified our flake armor three times. I know we've done it a couple of times. You passed by. It has three yet. Uh, can we? We can't raise horn yet. You. Uh, there was a crystal longsword on the ground for your. Yeah, we can come back and pick that up when we can carry it. Yeah, you're not gonna be able to raise <laughs> temper. <laughs> yeah. I feel like we should. Yeah. Yeah. Double muscled needs to catch up. It keeps getting um, uh, short ended because it, it's never going to break through, but it never breaks through. Yeah. Cause, yeah. Well, now we can hold an, an extra 10 dra uh, pounds of something. Ooh, ultra fire. Oh, man. Th these are good things. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that one's pretty good, too, honestly. A lot of skim softs, parabolic muscular, uh, eh, eigen rifle. With a fidget cell, what in the world? That thing wouldn't even be able to, like, shoot once. Yeah. Oh, we wow. found two eigen rifles apparently. Heck yeah. Freeze grenade mark three. Yo. Ah. What did I break? When did you break? You got five fixits. Oh, I guess you have repair. Yeah, you don't even need to. Yeah. Cannot repair it though. So I guess the fixits are still useful. Yeah, sure. Oh, wait. Do broken things sort first yet? No. No. They don't. Is that, is that being worked on? I had thought about doing that at some point. I don't remember if I did it or just thought about it. So. Uh, defoliant grenade. I apparently only thought about it. <laughs> when you think of about an update so much that you, you know, you just assume you, you did it already. Well, some things like thinking about it and doing it are basically the same. Uh... <laughs> Have I lost you? Yeah. No. I, uh, sorry, I got a message that I had to reply to. But so I guess, yeah, you did lose me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Another Eigen rifle. I assume we're going to be disassembling those. Yeah, I think we're going to carry a couple over to, um, they're only five bits, and I think we're doing all right on five bits now. Yeah, we got a few. Yeah. While we're here, though, oh, we can't learn that yet. We should be able to learn this. Yeah. We already knew fungicide pump. Yeah. I need to remember to, I guess I could just drop fungicide pump here on the ground. Uh, 
it might remind me that we're not over encumbered. See, we only have one six bit. Then you and there want are like three you... things we want to build with six bits because we're gonna want a recoiler. It'd be really nice to just finally make a stilt recoiler right now. Yeah. Um, I also want to pick up like a handrail and a geomat knight. You could make the reprogrammable recoiler for a shop. I honestly, I was gonna suggest. I know we have a need. For freehold but you could make a recoiler for right in front of like a good shopkeep at eat freehold and then you would be you could sell to them encumbered sure. um and then just like do that dump all of our stuff and then disassemble the recoiler and make a handrail or uh probably geomag yeah i think we have one more six bit in our inventory too that we haven't disassembled yet so i think we get like reprogrammable and geomagnetic and we probably just do stilt for now that's Sounds my good. Thoughts. Yep. Yeah, we still have the ontological anchor. Nice. Okay. All right. So, one of the problems is we have some like heavy artifacts, uh, like those boots. <laughs> there are more than one grounding. Oh, penticeps are so good. I love penticeps. Face harmonic. Oh, that's just for force fields. Actually, won't keep. We really don't need fungicide or defoliant right now. I don't think <laughs> we need the chrome key either. Or actually, do we need that to go downstairs? All right, fine. We're going to disassemble an eigen rifle. I think we do need the chrome key to get downstairs, don't we? I think so, yeah. But now do you? Like, do you now need that it every open, time? I don't think we need it again now. You're so old. You're so old? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he can teach me to craft Dazzle Cheeks. Heck yeah. Yeah. Didn't we already buy that d data disk? No, we didn't. Oh, amazing. Oh, 3D cobblers. I don't know what those are or how they work. Uh, it's, um... <laughs> yeah. oh, I can I can make my own wicker chairs. Is that what a, scare, a, sc a scrap has? In? It's like a... Yeah, I think it's like a tweed... Like, it's... Yeah, I think that's what it means. 3D cobblers, I believe, draw walls behind you as you walk. Oh, wow. So they're like portable wall, but on boots. Oh, that's really cool, actually. Yeah. All right. So anyway, all of this quest text doesn't change. So I'm not going to read it. You can but, learn about it by uh, playing Caves of Code. Yeah. You can experience it by playing the video game Caves of Code. 1.0, 2024. I think we said this checkpoint here. How long has our episode been? Uh, It has only been 24 minutes. Oh, wow. Well, okay. To be fair, there is a... Uh, Four oh, there's also the silence. 12 minutes of me yeah. not, yeah. Mm. Lol, I opened up this door. <laughs> uh, At least the communications thing is still there. Can you imagine you go to get to the front yeah. door of Gridgate and it's like, there's just the intercom? Yeah, the whole door has been blown up. All right, fine, we'll investigate some ruins. Heck yeah, getting distracted. Give the code. Blech. Hello, beeping. Wow, that beeping is very close. Yeah, it's like it's right outside my apartment. Beep. 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 The mating oh. call of reversing trucks everywhere. Love that. The mating call of reversing trucks. Oh, there's penticeps. Yeah, we had, we've had penticeps. I know. <laughs> Just every time they come up, you're going to be like, oh, there's penticeps. I love penticeps. All right, fine. We've disassembled all the eigen rifles. Uh, to be fair, I was not in favor of that necessarily. I know they were quite valuable to sell. Oh, this this is why we're... Hold on. <gasps> penticeps! We're... Yeah, penticeps! There they are again! Well, I mean, to, to be fair, we're over and covered we because... we can wear a gas mask. We're picking up fresh water for, for yeah. icon rifles. It seems highly counterintuitive. I agree, but we grabbed five bits. Ooh. Um, can, can, can we turn off... Uh, auto pick up fresh water. I think, are we like at that point? We probably could. I just never bother to. I, what I do instead is I just stop carrying as many water skins, like. Oh, uh, that's a good idea. That is a very good idea. It's sensible even. In fact, you know, it just occurs to me, you could set it up so that you only have two water skins filling up fresh water. And that would be enough that you would always, you know, you would only carry enough fresh water to live. Yeah, but it also makes, you know, the trading aspect a little weirder. Uh, if you ever do want to buy something 
Because you have to have, like, perfect change. Right. Yeah, you can actually see the zooting now. Right? It's pretty zoot. There's, there must be more. Oh, okay. we have a Dram and Neutron Flux. We sure do, but we're saving that. Yeah. Uh, I, I know we... I know how tempting it is, but it'd be better if we could... Oh, we've uh... got a bunch of Phase Silk now. Oh, yeah. It okay. might be worth... Oh, we should concede. Oh, my God. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, buddy. It's backing up into my apartment. Yeah, right. You'll just, like, you know, hear silence. The whole thing will end suddenly. Oh, I phased. This is yeah, I don't think now. the I don't think the the volume was as low as you thought it was when you kept telling me the volume was low. No, honestly, this is good. It's it's, it's like this is acceptable. All right. Well, I guess it is hitting ten. I guess I could stand to turn it down a little bit, but I can turn it down on my end. It's always better to turn it down on your end. Yeah. Problem is that yeah, I guess if it is too loud, it's gonna uh prop the editor. I guess I just like to hear it. This is totally gonna be an oops who killed the legendary moment. Just want you to know. Pantasubs. Pantasubs! Oh, hey. Actually, I think you will have to turn it down on your end. I think I, I bunged it. I messed up. Castle face. That's about where it was before. Perfect. Uh... I was debating if I wanted to pick one of those up and mod it, but I think we got a better cloak. Okay, we we don't care if they're scoped, they're still trash. <laughs> okay. Alright, we're just killing them anyway. No need to be accidental about it. Raw worm meat. Wow. Let's get some jerky. killed the legendary. I don't know why I'm bothering to kill everything else in here, because I don't think any of it's giving us XP, now that we're level 30. Yeah. But, I don't know, he might have had a fun box in here or something. I just kind of want to auto-explore it. <laughs> Meh. Alright. Let's get back on track. We were so close. See, I think the most important programmable recoiler we could build based on what we've done so far is right here. Right here. <laughs> oh, why is that? I feel like a full chem cell should have been enough. It's um, it's funny. Uh, I think th different recoilers seem to use different amounts of charge. Yeah. And I think reprogrammable. I think the reprogrammable are... is just really. We have um high capacity the mod, right? We do, and I think we also ha have a better cell than that in our. In our forest bracelet. Well, we don't want to rob that. Uh, well, I was thinking about just... Well, hold on. Uh, replace cell. Remove cell. Ink ring. Mod. Thing is, I don't know if a high capacity chem cell is enough. But I'm going to try doing... Just looking at some of these other things in here. But, uh... Where did that other battery go? The one that was already radio powered, high capacity. High capacity radio powered. All right. We might have to just get a better cell. Might have to make a nuclear. 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 It's pronounced nuclear. Nuclear. Um, what are we looking for here? Reprogrammable. Well, now that we've emptied the uh, thermoelectric cell, we could just assume. All right, so let's try the full high. Like, if this doesn't do it, we need a nuclear cell. Yeah. Yeah. This is the other reason why I like the regular programmable one. I don't think it requires as much juice to imprint. Yeah, that makes sense. So, do we build a nuclear cell just to be able to imprint this thing? That seems like a really big waste of a 6-bit to me. I think we might just have to walk back here again the next time we want to come. The other question is, is it time to turn in the books? We are level 30. We might as well. 
no sense in hoarding them if you don't that's a, use them all. We're, we're about to hand in a lot of books uh-huh many books uh-huh all right i mean uh, yeah level 30 is i mean it's a good it's a good time good lord it's a really long Sixty-nine thousand eight hundred and forty-one XP. Almost a perfect amount of XP. It was that only one level. Yep. Wow. Well, it, it was most of us another level. Good lord. I think that's one we of the reasons I don't turn in the books. I, I, I think that's one of the reasons I don't do this anymore. Is because um, I listen. Uh, you know, two levels at this stage is valuable. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna underplay that. But also, ten levels near the beginning is super valuable. Yeah, except for then you just took all the value out of all the things that you would have done to gain those 10 levels. Right, but I also took out a lot of the danger. I suppose. I, I mean, well, I, different methods. It wasn't really dangerous yet. We haven't gotten to danger yet. I suppose. IMO. Like, the risky part of the run is coming up, right? Right. Anyway, let's, uh, let's, that's a good place to leave it. Um, if you are enjoying this series, definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this, and we'll see you guys next time. Take it easy. Yes.